So the question number one is like, Example of number one is like if the voltage, it's a, it's a question of the uh, string efficiency. If the voltage across the total string is 30 volt, so we total is 30 volts, and, and the voltage across the unit adjacent to the line conductor is 10 volts. So V1 is 10 volts, and if there are uh, uh, the string efficiency is given as 0.6. And so we have to find the number of discs. And find Voltage rating of string. So, this is a direct form of right now, nothing very much special in this, but since this is a question of an objective type, so we are solving this. So, uh, finding the so what is string efficiency is equals to V total divided by L into V1. V total is the total voltage across the whole string and the V1 is the uh, uh, voltage near uh, of the unit adjacent to the line conductor. So everything is almost given so we can have L is equal to Vp is here 30 divided by V1 is given as 10 multiplied by String efficiency is 0.6. So the n is coming over here as 5. So the total number of discs in the conductor is 5. <coughs> so it is not uh, volts, it's kilovolts. So we can say that if the num total number of discs are 5, so so the rating of the total string is, so rating as we discussed in suspension type of oscillator that each and every uh, disk is approximately 11 kilovolt. So here the total number of disks are 5. So the rating of the string would be 11 into 5 that is equals to 55 kilovolt. So 55 kilovolt is the uh, total number of the rating of the string, whereas the total rating of the conductor voltage is 30 uh, kilovolts. So the number of discs are more. So in this, in the same question, we can have uh, uh, something like uh, asking about the whether the uh, rating of the string is able to support the uh, voltage or not. So here it is able to support the voltage. But if it was more than this, then maybe possible that the end will increase, but rating of the string will be lesser. So that in that case, uh, the uh, this conductor will not be able to withstand that much of voltage, and there may be a fault condition into it. <coughs> so now. We can go for an example number two. It says that the puncture voltage of a uh, insulator is 11 kilovolt. And flash over voltage. is equals to 10 kilovolt. So find the factor of safety. So this is a direct question. We can directly solve this question. Likewise that factor of 
safety for any insulator is equals to the puncture voltage divided by the <coughs> flash over voltage. So we can have directly this thing that the puncture voltage is 11 kilo volt and the flash over voltage is 10. So we have 1.1 as figure of safety. So this figure of safety should be as high as possible. One should have highest figure of safety in case of the types of the insulators. <coughs> in the likewise, another question can come in the example number three. It's a, again a uh, question from an objective type uh, examination, and this question says that. Uh, Flash over voltage. It's a string efficiency question as we can see. The, the string efficiency question, and we have to find the string efficiency so the flash over voltage, the total flash over voltage of the string is given as. Is equals to 3 kilo volt and the uh, voltage across the uh, voltage uh, uh, the flash over voltage uh, of the unit adjacent to the line conductor is is 1 kilo volt so and number of this are 3 so find, we have to find the string efficiency again this is a direct question from which uh, we can say that the string efficiency is equals to the flash over voltage V flash over voltage of the total divided by N which is the number of this multiplied by the voltage across the adjacent conductor V flash over voltage is 1 Vf1 we can say so the flash over voltage total flash over voltage is 3 kilo volts divided by the number of disks is 3 here and Voltage, the flash over voltage of the unit adjacent to the line conductor is 1 kilovolt. So, string efficiency would be equal to 1. So, this is the string efficiency we are getting right now, this is as 1. So, these three four type of example are now being asked in, uh, when it's numerical part and whatever we started in line insulators and uh, conductors and supports. So uh, that the normal uh, objective type of question are asked are from the theory part only. So please remember both the things theory part as well as the some formulas which are which we have discussed and which we have uh, done some problems on those.